Welcome back to News Watch and happy Tuesday morning, Southern West Virginia. Temperatures out there, not a bad start for our Tuesday morning in the low to mid 40s. 41 in Oak Hill, 42 in Beckley, 43 in Pipestem. Up in Pocahontas County, 40 degrees. So not a bad start for you guys up there either. So compared to the rest of the region, we are seeing pretty mild, slightly cooler temperatures to our north, 37 in Pittsburgh, 35 in Columbus, 40 in Louisville. Just to our south, Roanoke, 52, 50 in Raleigh, North Carolina, 45 in Richmond. So everyone's seeing that pleasant and mild star out there this morning. And if we look ahead for your coffee forecast, grab that medium as you head out the door this morning with that current temperature of 42 and mostly cloudy. That's all you should need to get started for your day today as we warm up into the low 50s this afternoon. So we'll be dealing with those cloudy conditions throughout the day, but that sunshine is going to peak out by the afternoon and that's going to help us warm up into the low 50s this afternoon so not a bad afternoon a little bit cooler but certainly not a bad day and temperatures tonight going to fall back down into the 40s with a slight chance later tonight of some isolated showers but now we're dry across southern West Virginia. Clouds filling in though across on that visit visible satellite. We're seeing some showers across Tennessee right now that may shift into our area and develop later tonight with some isolated showers across the area combining with this system off to the west. But not going to be a washout, just a few sprinkles here and there to end our Tuesday. We're dry for Wednesday, we're dry for Thursday, but Friday we have the potential for some widespread showers across the area Friday into Friday night into Saturday morning. But that's going to move out quickly by Saturday. We dry out Sunday looking pretty dry. And then on Monday, we do have the potential for some more scattered showers continuing into Tuesday of next week. So for that upcoming weather pattern late tonight, those isolated showers move into our area. This is about 11 o'clock tonight. That's going to move out. We're dry for the day on Wednesday. We're dry for the day on Thursday. We even start Friday morning drive. We can see that rain approaching from the west Friday morning. By Friday afternoon, that rain moves in. It sticks around until Saturday morning. This is at 11.30 a.m. Saturday morning, and then we'll see rain finally moving out to end the day on Saturday. So for your seven-day forecast, some isolated showers likely late tonight. Very slight chance, though. Temperatures reach the low 50s this afternoon. We're dry through Wednesday and Thursday, partly cloudy. Temperatures reaching the mid-50s. Then on Friday, we could see even some rumbles of thunder here and there as rain moves in across the the area temperatures into the low to mid 60s this weekend and we'll see some rain continuing Saturday morning then we dry out for the rest of the weekend with temperatures reaching very warm on Monday 68 and mostly sunny 